Using religion as a tool for violence was firmly denounced by Vatican officials during the annual conference in the Italian city of Rimini. The Vatican's president of the Pontifical Council for Interreligious Dialogue had this to say about the matter. Pope Francis says this quite often. He says, one cannot kill in the name of God. This criminal activity is simply not justified. During an interreligious roundtable discussion, Cardinal Jean-Louis Toran pointed out the religious extremism that's growing in different parts of the world. He described it as dangerous because it mixes fundamentalism with dogma to justify its identity. All of us, Jews, Christians and Muslims, have to highlight our cultural and religious roots. As Pope Francis notes in his latest encyclical, most people describe themselves as believers. This very fact should motivate religious people to engage in dialogue and work together to protect Mother Nature, the poor, to foster respect and brotherhood. The Rimini meeting is organized by the Communion and Liberation Movement. The first one took place back in 1980, and eventually it became a tradition. In fact, the UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon sent in a video message to support the interreligious meeting. There's a long list of topics and discussions that will take place. This one was to highlight that religion is part of the solution and not the problem. It's God who wants you to exist. It's God who wants this religious diversity. It's God who wants Christians, Muslims and Jews to live in harmony. Uniformity is dangerous for mankind. If we are all the same, there's nothing to exchange. No one grows and no one moves forward. The meeting, which is expected to bring in thousands of people from all over the world, will run from August 20th to the 26th.